Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Um, today, this video is about uh, a Chanel boy bag that I've actually purchased a year ago, and it is a pre love boy bag. So, this was actually my first boy bag, and I did mention on my other videos previously that um, I was about to unveil this, but I don't have it at the moment because I actually sent it to New York, well, to the US, to the States, to authenticate this. I mean, when I first purchased this from a Canadian pre-love website, it is locally in Toronto and it's called Back Religion. I know for a fact that it is a genuine Chanel boy bag but as time goes by for some reason I just feel that it is in lambskin but I just feel that it feels very rubberish and it does not feel like a ladder to me and it just gets me a little bit worried even though I believe it is a genuine boy bag from Chanel and it does come with the authenticity card when I purchase it. Obviously it comes with the dust bag as well. But um it just have I do have that doubt at the back of my mind no matter how small it is. But to ease my mind I actually send it to the States to authenticate it. I send it to this company. It's called Authenticate First and apparently it is one of the highly um recommended authentications company so I'm just gonna send I'm just gonna show you I just received this yesterday but bear in mind you need to send the bag itself they need to see the physical bag for some serial number above I believe it's above 15 any any Chanel bag that's after the 15 series they actually require to see a physical authentications of the back um, anything below under 15 serial number you can simply just send pictures to them but above 15 series they need to look at the back physically and that's the reason why I sent this this is actually the 20 series if I'm not mistaken so I just got this back and it was a huge relief because they confirmed that it is a genuine Chanel bag and from the history, from the company history, they have never ever authenticated an item which is incorrect. So they do have that credentials and that confirms my it kind of gives me an assurance but let me just show you what it is because when they send it back to me it does come back in an envelope with a certificate and bear in mind if you send it back to the states they need to send it back to you and um, depending on your country you might incur a custom duties or an import duties because the bag was actually sent to a different country but it was actually sent back to you as a consumer you might incur that so that is something that you have to speak to them about that and just be prepared to pay for that extra custom duties when they return the bag to you um, but obviously if you actually are residing in the States you don't have that issues it's only for customers that reside outside the States and um, it is an international thing but let me just show you what the certificate looks like so this is what they gave me and this is the name card authenticate first and Gina Nixon she's been excellent in um, returning my mails about um, because of the COVID-19 there are a lot of delays of the the mails from Canada to US the UPS so USPS they actually um, respond to my email very quickly and Gina herself sent me a lot of emails regarding some of the issues that I was worried about but they did authenticate this back 
and it is proved to be authentic. And that's the actual bag itself, and that's the serial number that I have. It is the 20 series, and I was just so glad that it was actually authentic. And let me just show you the bag itself. It is in orange, and this is the medium size. And the metal itself, the, the hardware itself, it's in that rusty metal look, which is quite common in the older series and it comes in that shoulder strap and it does have that effect throughout all the hardware and this is made in France um, and there is a slight mark which was notified it was actually on the website um, let me just show you I purchased this from this website. It's called Back Religion, and they are a Toronto-based pre-love company. So this was actually my first, and I believe my only purchase from them. Um, let me just show you. And everything seems to look genuine, and I was quite confident I did actually email someone online that does authentications and he assured me that it is a genuine Chanel bag but over time it just makes me worry because of the material it is in lambskin but it just feels kind of like rubberish over time it just feels like a rubber and it does makes me worry it. and um, again I was so glad that two third party two part companies actually confirmed that it is a real Chanel bag and um, I was glad and that's the reasons why I am showcasing on my YouTube video now just show you what the bag looks like I love the color the orange color it is so unique from Chanel they don't usually have this kind of pop-up colors and I do understand it does have quite a few marks here and there's quite a few wear and tear and um, I'm just gonna show you how much I pay for this I still have the receipt and I do keep and this is where they're from back religion so they are a online company based in Toronto and um, let me show you that's the name card and this is the authenticity card which matches the serial number in there and also uh, the receipt that I got from back religion when I purchase it so I do have the receipt back and I'm just gonna show you what it looks like but i'm just gonna I, I just need to cover some of the details my personal details that's the old medium orange boy bag and i actually paid three thousand five hundred canadian dollars for that and with tax and shipping and everything it comes out to just under four thousand and they do assure that all items are 100 percent authentic guarantee but um, over time, I just felt that it was, it just felt a little bit rubberish. And that's the re reason why I sent it to authenticate first to do authentications, which I was glad. Um, I actually spent $100 for the authentications and I need to pay a little bit of customs when I receive the bag. And I also have to pay for shipping costs and everything. So all in all, I pay over $200 just to have that peace of mind and confirmations that this is actually an authentic Chanel bag. And just to show you that this is actually their company, Bag Religion, they're based in Toronto and that's the website and they do have a lot of Chanel bags in there if you're interested in the pre-love market and they do carry a lot of different brands as well such as Hermes 
and Dior and other brands. So um, thanks so much for watching. I just want to showcase a pre-love Chanel boy bag that I have. And this was actually my first boy bag which at that time um, I decided to try and that's the reasons why I went for the pre-love market but I do love the boy bag from Chanel and I did purchase a brand new one from the boutique it was unboxed um, a couple of weeks ago the fascia if you do want to watch that I'm gonna link the video down below but once again if you do have any questions, please do so on the comments below. And thanks so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already.